Hello everybody, we're back again and we heard you loud and clear last week. So girls, I know we gave you the tall girls um, little show last week and this week we're going to dress the petite girls or for the little girls in our um, out there world. So girls, I've got Rainy with us today and we've got a few top tips um, to share with you today and some really important things that we want to let you know on how to dress for a little petite girl. So Rainy's gonna come out first with her first outfit. I know some of you asked, Hi, could you wear the Falling For You cardigan? Now, this is our boho bestseller. It is. And Rainy's it's got nice. it on in the port color, port. And she's breaking it up with a little scarf there, which is great. The first tip, girls, I will say to you is try and go for a monochromatic underneath. So we've got the white jeans and the white top, which is elongating Rainy's body. It's also a bit lower here, so it's keeping her in proportion. She's got a nude shoe on. Nude is your best friend, girls, because it will elongate your legs. Um, she's even getting away with these great little espadrilles here for summer that have got a little ankle strap. And you can get away with that, girls, because they are nude. Try not to wear an ankle strap if it's coloured or black because it will cut the leg off and cut that line. So the Falling For You Cardi, you know, girls, comes in lots of colours. Um, we thought we'd put the port on here, which I think is a great little colour. And Rainy's just going to show you the little strap on this shoe. So she's got the Wake Skinny Jean. Girls, another tip to remember is remember structure and flow. So if you've got a skinnier leg on, try not to go for a wide leg pant or too much flare. It will cut you off and keep you, it won't elongate your line. So that great little skinny jean there looks great, Rainy. Yeah, so we've great. got another item to pop on with that. So we've got the everyday blazer. So you could say that this is, yep, questions? We've got a question from Karina. Could you please tell me the brand and the name of the singlet that Rainy's wearing? Rainy is wearing the Runaway Singlet from Boho. It comes in uh, black as well, and we use it, I think, in every live. It's a great staple piece to have in your wardrobe to wear underneath items. This is another great outfit. We've put the scarf on for a pop of color, but if Lorraine took that scarf off, this, Everyday blazer is giving her beautiful shape. It's coming in at the waist. It's got a great little cut at the back. Three quarter sleeve girls is great for our petite girl. So the sleeve's not too long. She's got a bit of shoulder pad there. So that is her structure in there. And with the white jeans, it looks fantastic. We're going to pop that blazer on with something else as well. Great colours um, too. Yeah, it looks fantastic. We've got another item to show you. The other thing that I want to talk about with the um, Falling For You cardigan girls is the way that it's cut. It's cut rounded at the front and if you're going to get a long line blazer I would go for a rounded corner as well because it will actually elongate that length, length there into your legs and up into your waist. So Lorraine's going to pop another little long line cardi on here. This is the new Keepers. It's a little bit sheer. It comes in three colours. It comes in navy black and khaki, I'm pretty sure. Sorry. I'm stuck. Sorry. <laughs> so again, there's a little bit happening here, but it works really well. You've got the long line monochromatic underneath, so you've got the all white underneath, which is giving you height and length, girls. A nice necklace here or another scarf. coloured scarf. How's that feel, Rainy? Great. And don't always remember three quarter sleeves. So this is a longer sleeve and I'll just or you can roll it up, girls. Roll. Yeah, whatever works for you better. And cuffing your pants, that's another trick. If you can't get the right length pant, cuff your pants. Yep. Often, girls, you'll look for a three-quarter or a seven-eighth. Would you do that, Rainy? Seven-eighth. Yeah, Is so length we've, we've got lots on the site. We've got lots of cropped pants like that. They're perfect for the petite girl. They'll finish mid. Nice with a little wedge. Yep, you could wear them with a wedge. You could dress those up or down. Um, they are by Whisper, a new, a new label for us. Um, these Gordon Smith cropped jeans are great. They were good. Yeah, they fitted really well. So, Rainy, I think you've got to go and pop another outfit on. So, yep. And we just have somebody asking what the brand of Rainy's shoes were again. They're a human premium. So, they're just new. Um, on the site, have a little look there. I think Lorraine's got her name on those. I think she's going to buy those. They're a great, great heel. 
and just enough for the petite girl to give you a little bit more height. Um, so don't be scared to, to wear flats either, girls. We're going to actually show you, Lorraine, in some flats as well. A really big tip we want to give you, girls, is not to be scared and not to shy away from fashion pieces because of your height. So a good tip would be to get yourself a good sewing lady or some, a friend that might be able to sew, or you might be able to sew yourself or go to a tailor. But there are going to be items that you will have to hem. So just because they're fashion pieces, um, it doesn't mean you can't wear them because you're short. You might just have to hem them up a bit. And there are things like, you know, um, this maxi dress. Yep. Just a quick question. What brand were those jeans again that you had? Okay, the denim jeans are Gordon Smith. They're fantastic. They're called the Miracle Denim Cropped Jean. They're really high-waisted. That's another thing, girls. High-waisted, fantastic. If you can do a little bit of a tuck, um, will elongate your leg as well. Um, great jeans. So this dress here, Rainy's going to wear this. It's just got a simple straight hem all the way along the bottom. So you might only have to take it up an inch or so. Really easy job to do. Sorry, we had another question. Sorry, another question. Does wearing scarves around the neck make you look shorter? It can, but the way we had it on the rain was we actually had it down and didn't to do the circle around. So what that is doing is it's actually giving you lines. Lines, remember girls, try and draw that line up and down because that's what's going to give you your height or your um, attempt, looking like height. Anyway. <laughs> Attempted height. Attempted height. So here comes Rainy. So a great brand, this one we'd love to tell you about is Hatley. So the denim jacket and the dress is by Hatley. It's a UK brand. Um, have a look on our site. They are, the dresses are fantastic for petite girls. So you'll see the model on our site will probably be at about 176 centimetres tall. Rainy's 157. 57, okay. <laughs> she tried to tell her daughter she was 165. <laughs> yeah. Didn't work. She said, I don't think so, Mum. So, perfect length on Rainy. It's to the knee. Hatley make great dresses for winter that you can wear leggings underneath and great for this time of year as well. So, these are the summer, spring, summer, summer range. Fabrics. Great little denim jacket. Do you want to take that jacket off, Rainy, to show? And you can see Lorraine's got a pair of white runners on with this. And you could actually have done the little wedge with that as well, don't you think, Lorraine? Right, gorgeous. Nice Very little cute. detail on the sleeve. Beautiful. Really soft yeah. fabric, isn't Beautiful it? Beautiful fabric, yeah. Great cut, too. And nice. they've got some really fun prints, girls. There's a little bit of colour, a little bit of yeah. pink. They've got pops of bright colours in them as well, as well as having some basic navy and white stripes. Like so this, where they've just popped a bit of a trim. Yeah. just takes it from being a little spot to really cute. something else. Very comfy. I could see you on your sailing boat with that, Rainy. Lots of sailing boats in Kuma. Next time you, <laughs> <laughs> next time you travel to Europe, that's, it, that's going in the suitcase. <laughs> and really good yeah, fabric really too. It's not fabric. too crushy. Yeah. Thank you. All good? Yeah. Okay, so I'll just tell you about my outfit. I've actually got, um, I'm 167 centimetres tall and I've got a bird by design um, jumpsuit on. So I'm wearing a size 12 in this. It's got pockets, um, a great sleeve, girls, for those of you that like to cover your arm a little bit. And it's um, sort of fitted in here. So a really nice pattern. It is so, so light, honestly, and it doesn't crush. I literally got this out of the bag from the warehouse and popped it on, so we didn't even steam it. So, great outfit, yep. We have a lovely customer, Vanessa, saying, what about the plus size shorties? And I know you've got great tips for curvy girls who are a little shorter. We have, we have good tips for curvy girls. So, um, girls, what I suggest for the curvier girl, the petite curvier girl, is to wear things, stick with your basic rules. Your structure and flow, so keep the structure in your pants, keep the slim leg line, and always accentuate your good points. So if you are heavier in the bottom, still keep those um, pants nice and slim fitting, but bring attention to the top. So maybe a pattern or a looser fitting shirt. If you're heavier in the top, open this neckline up. You can use soft, loose fabrics at the top 
A button shirt is good with maybe a cami underneath and that can be left open a little bit, but keep that structure and flow. You can still do a blazer, remember a blazer, and remember your monochromatic colors. So try and dress in similar tones and similar colors. It will elongate your body. And also girls, don't worry about, the length is going to be longer when you upsize for a petite curvier girl. So you are going to get a little bit more length. So remember to find that good seamstress and don't be afraid to hem. Please don't be afraid to hem. Just don't shy away from clothes like that. I know Rainy cuts things off lots of times. <laughs> yep. Sorry, Sandy. Another question from Ali. Can we see that jumpsuit with the denim jacket? Yes. And I would do it with a denim jacket and I'd also do it with a white runner. So, um, There you go. I've actually got a little blazer that I was going to put on with it as well, so I'll pop that on in a minute. So this works quite well. Great little denim jacket. It's got some nice features, this Hatley denim jacket. Thank you very much. So come on, Rainy. Here she comes. She's going to have a maxi dress on. So girls that are scared to actually wear, <laughs> wear a maxi. So Lorraine's in a 10. Now, if you were to size up in this, that's fine for the curvy girl. It's got a good scoop neckline. So what you would do is you would hem it a little bit and bring it up, depending where you want it. And you could actually then put some accessories with it. So you can either have a little denim jacket on it, and Rainy's got slats on, which look really cute. A really easy way to wear that. You could pop a scarf on with that. So this is a keeper's dress. Um, it's one of our best sellers, it comes in black as well. And then we're going to dress it up a little bit. So you could actually wear this dress out as well. And you're going to pop some heels on. Right. Hold on. <laughs> we don't want to fall, Maddie. <laughs> so this is again the everyday blazer, which is one of our best selling pieces. I think. Girls, I think some of them are out of stock, but just remember they are a bestseller and they will be back in stock all, all the time. So just request your item and you'll be let know when they come back into yeah. stock. I love this look on Lorraine, all your colours. Yeah, That's a beautiful colors. blazer. Looks fantastic. So what do you think, girls? You can wear a maxi. Yes, questions? The question I have is that they're loving the jumpsuit, but would it suit short? She's the same height as Rainy. Yes, yeah, so you would, again, this is about a bit of a 7 8 length. I'm wearing a 12, so they are quite short. So I think it would be quite long on Rainy uh, or a petite girl, but you could actually hem it quite easily. It's got like a little rolled hem here. I would just turn it up one more time and run the sewing machine around that again, and I think you would find it perfect. It's really good length in the body as well. Yep. And another quick one, what colour is the blazer that Rainy's wearing? It's called Moose. <laughs> yeah, so there's, I think there's Moose and Stone and yeah. Pink and Black. I'll just pop the black one on with this. Excuse We're getting lots of creases. lovely comments about the dress on you, Rainy. Oh, nice. She's going to do another maxi for you. So do you want to go off and do that one, Rainy? So this is the black. Please excuse the creases in this everyday blazer, but I just grabbed it again out of the warehouse because I thought just to show you what the jumpsuit would look like with this blazer on. Um, and the other thing you could do with this, girls, is actually if you were tall, you could wear this and you could actually wear a black belt around here so it would actually break that whole line up. Petite girls, I would keep this going though. Keep the pattern going, okay? And you could actually do the Falling For You Cardi with this as well, a little bit more long line. Sorry, Sandy. Yep. Is there any chance you could pop sneakers on with Ooh, the jumpsuit? Oh, I've got my sneakers over there. Do you want to bring those out, Josie, and I'll bring them just... Okay. And will the blazer fit over arms? that are always a couple of sizes bigger at the top of the sleeve. Yeah, so this sleeve is so light and fluffy. The girls actually asked um, what it was like on, and it, you cannot feel the sleeve underneath this blazer. I'm being really honest, girls. It's so light. And what size blazer have you got on there, Sandy? I've got the 12 on. And the I brand? 
It's, it's a keeper's blazer, the everyday blazer. And I would size up in the blazer, girls, because it is a little bit tighter. It's got stretch, it's fantastic. But I would definitely do this with my runners. Sorry, I've got my old ones on, girls. <laughs> Wasn't planning on wearing my runners. Definitely do the runner with this. And I would do this with the runner, but I'd actually put the denim jacket on with it to dress it down a bit. So the great thing about this jumpsuit is you can dress it up or down. And that's the great thing about most jumpsuits, I think. <laughs> because we've got some fun happening. <laughs> Rangi's having trouble putting this dress on. <laughs> Sorry, my I've question. got a question for you, Sandy. Would that jumpsuit suit a bigger bust? Yes, so we've got the V here, and there's plenty of room here. And girls, it's got this really nice little cut down here where the ruffle starts from. So I actually feel like it would really make that shape really go well. Then it's well fitted under here. You can wear a good bra underneath it as well. Remembering it's got this V, which is great for the bigger bust. How are we going? Has she got this outfit on yet? <laughs> I've got one more for you, Sandy, as yeah. well. As if we have time, could you put one of the cardies on over the jumpsuit of so course. we can see that look? Of course, not a problem. Here's another little jumpsuit that I thought, this is a Cordelia straight one. Um, Rainy had this on, fantastic. It actually is a 7 8 length on me, which looks great, but a little bit longer on the petite girl. Great with this overlay. Absolutely love this little jumpsuit. That would be great for a cocktail event. I know someone was asking about cocktail events for petite girls. That would be perfect. Okay, here she comes finally. Where she is. <laughs> and this oh. was a request, is that right, Sandy? Yeah. This is this a request. Outfit last week. So last week we had um, someone ask us if a petite girl could actually wear this outfit. Now I actually bought this outfit and I think I wore it in the Boho Live, which um, I love. And I wore it to work yesterday. Super easy. Lorraine had a bit of trouble putting it on, but that's okay. I'm just trying to find a cardi I can put on with this. Right, I'm going to put the fall in for you. So you imagine this in a different colour. And this, you'll see how light the sleeve is under this. You can't even really see it underneath. So you could do a cardi with it quite easily. I'll find that sheer, sheer, sheery one as well. Oh, it might be over there, the navy one. Okay, here she comes. She's ready. I'm back. <laughs> so, <laughs> she, she had it on. <laughs> so it's the tea back maxi, I think, from Boho Bird and the long sleeve tea underneath. So a great dress. Rainy's got it. It is a little bit long, as we've said, but Really, really easy to hem, girls. It's just two pieces, front and back. Very easy. And you could just turn it up an inch. So remembering that this is going to fit you, it needs to be quite fitted. Again, perfect for the bigger bust as well because we've got this V at the front and it's breaking everything up. Just turn around and show them the back. It's a great dress. I love that outfit. So for, for the lady out there that asked for this outfit on the petite girl, the other reason why it works is because of the side the slits. Slit. Yeah. So it breaks that up as well. But look at how tall she looks in it. Because it's all black. Six foot? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we'll try it. So you can imagine this one, um, this comes in black, this cardi. And I'm not sure, it might be a bit different because it's see-through and you might be able to see the sleeves through it. But you can imagine a long, a long line cardi. I think Boho have got one out at the moment that's not see-through that I think would work quite well over the top of this jumpsuit. So as you can see, you would all know that jumpsuits are my favourite and dresses because you only have to think of one item to put on underneath, but you can accessorise with so many other things, which we love. Um, I'm just going to show you a few other things for the petite girl. Petite girls, this is a great little item for you when it finishes just here. So again, you might have all black underneath or all white underneath and then you pop this on and it just creates a different line and gives you a waist and gives you some shape. So that's a by design little, sort of like a little... Um, Cropped jacket. And somebody did ask Sandy, crop jackets for the petite girl. Crop jackets. In perfect. denim and other yes. forms work. Don't go too long, girls. Cropped and shape. 
So remember your structure and flow. So if you're going to put a jacket on, it needs to have a bit of structure and it needs to stop at the right place. So remember your proportions. Wasted things, high waisted, um, tuck in, tuck into your pants so it elongates your leg and give yourself shape. Even if you are curvier or you're a little bit bricky through here, it doesn't matter. Put your all black or all white underneath and use your blazer to give you that shape or your jacket um, or your little cropped. So you can imagine this would just, you probably should try it on maybe, would just stop in the right spot. It just stops here, it gives you that little bit of shape. Asymmetrical lines are also really good, really good girls, because it draws the eye away. And small patterns and small accessories. Not big handbags, go for small dainty things, girls. The bigger it is, it will accentuate your petiteness. So try and keep things in proportion. All right, here comes Rainy. She's got a new by design dress on um, in a great pattern. Now this is another request. Someone asked what could a petite girl wear to a cocktail party? This would be perfect. The jumpsuit I showed you before would be perfect. Um, Lorraine has worn this outfit before as well. Another perfect item, it's from Moonlight Bird. This one's from By Design. This jumpsuit would be perfect for a cocktail party as well. Wedding. Yeah, this is a great little shape, girls. It's straight underneath the tube dress and then it's got this beautiful um, overlay, chiffon overlay at the top. Comes in black as well. Great for the arms. Yeah. So, the tummy. a few tips. Remember your structure and flow. Get yourself a good sewing lady. Lorraine cuts all her things off. She cuts the tails off. And um, hem, don't be scared of buying fashion pieces because of your height. Have a go, experiment. I'm sure you'll be really happy um, when you've had them hemmed and you're feeling like you, know, you haven't had to not buy something because you're short. So. Nothing wrong with that, girls. No. <laughs> and yeah, patterns are great too, but just keep them small, small nothing too yeah. big, nothing too big and bold, and not too bright a colour. So hopefully, we have covered a few yeah. little tips. Just embrace yeah. where we are. Yeah. Yeah. Bye. We love it. Thank you. Thanks, girls. And we hope to see you again next week. Um, keep the requests coming, and we will try and answer them for you. <laughs>